you know, when rich kids get on, on they go to rehab. Poor kids get on drugs, they, they go to prison. I've seen that my whole life. Take our responsibility now. It will be the African American community that picks the next Democratic president, a candidate, and it will be our sacrifice to get Trump out of office. And so we have to now grow up into a different level of responsibility. If democracy is going to be saved, it's going to be saved by black. If the economy is going to work for anybody, it's going to be because we insist. And so that puts us in a very different situation than we've ever really been in before. Because, you know, you think, you know, when rich kids get on, on they go to rehab. Poor kids get on drugs, they go to prison. I've seen that my whole life. Take our responsibility now. It will be the African American community that picks the next Democratic president, a candidate, and it will be our sacrifice to get Trump out of office. took a sip of Flint's filtered tap water, uh, assuring the people the there now. that this he cares. I've got your back. Not too long ago, I received a letter. The president singled out eight-year-old Mari Kopany. Mr. President. She wrote him a letter in March, expressing her concerns about the water. How would you describe the Flint water? It's nasty. Why is it nasty? It gives you bad rashes and headaches. Flint's water crisis began two years ago, after the city switched its water supply from Detroit to the Flint River to save money. The water wasn't treated for corrosion, causing lead to leach from aging pipes. Three government workers have been charged with misconduct and conspiracy to tamper with evidence. One of them was arraigned today and pleaded no contest. Though officials now say filtered tap water is safe, many, like Paris James, don't believe it. When they said it was okay, it wasn't really okay. The single mother's daily routine begins at six in the morning. Her three children get ready for school using bottled water. She drives them 20 minutes outside of Flint to her parents' house to bathe. So you refuse to pay your water bill? Mm -hmm. Why pay for poison? To date, the city has handed out more than 24 million bottles of water and over 100,000 filters. Scott, the mayor here, says she wants to replace all of the pipes, but right now there just is not enough money to do that. Jerika Duncan reporting. Jerika, thank you.